it's been a long time so welcome back to my channel if you're watching i think it's been like about six months since i've posted a video a lot has happened in six months i've been really busy and actually i've kind of um unfortunately slowed down a lot in my crafting um i did some markets in the um in the christmas period and really have had enough of doing markets um, because it really took me away from doing what I really love, which is collecting the ephemera. If you've been watching my video, you know that I love collecting paper, putting that paper together. Um, and I thought that I'd get into markets, but it's just really, it just really wasn't worth it. And it really made me legitimately like hate walking into my craft room to feel like I had to make things for profit. Um, so I'm back again and I'm here with some fun things. I'm here with some new Disney ephemera packs. So these are perfect if you're looking at starting a vintage Disney journal. This is actually pretty much my, almost my entire Disney collection. I'm putting into packs and selling because I had these grand plans of making a Disney journal Unfortunately, I'm just way too busy now to be creating <laughs> those journals and I'm really starting to go back, scale back to um, just collecting the ephemera and selling the ephemera. And so I thought I'd hate to see all of this gorgeous vintage Disney stuff sitting around. Um, it's, you know, it, I'm never gonna, to be quite honest, I'm just way too busy now that I can't make a Disney journal. Um, I can hardly keep up with my travel journaling when I travel. So I've, I've got like three tr trips um, that I still need to journal for. Um, so I was like, you know what, let's just get rid of this Disney stuff. I can start collecting again and um, share some of my collection with you all. So I've got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10 Disney packs that I'm going to be listing in the Etsy store. They're all going to be a combined collection of different stuff. Um, and if you're seeing this video, watching this video, it means that the listing is up on Etsy. So if you like what you see, please feel free to jump on there and grab one. I won't be able to put uh, words like Disney or Mickey Mouse or anything like that in the um, listing title. So you'll just have to go uh, through, either follow the link that I've put in the description below, um, or you'll just have to go through my store and look for this. Because as we know, um, Disney does not like you using their name to sell anything. <laughs> but all of these papers are original uh, vintage papers from about the 1990s and, uh, and older. And most of it is from like the 70s and 80s. So I'm gonna go through the piles and show you what you've got in here. Each pile's got kind of similar stuff, so just stuff from the, from the same kind of resources or the same books and things. Um, but yeah, let me know if you love it and if it's what you're looking for. I know lots of people are looking for new Disney or old Disney stuff. So um, in each pack, you tend to get a little golden book front cover some pages from some vintage 19, late 1960s, 1970s comic books. So that's a, that was a goofy one. This one looks like a uh, Mickey Mouse one as well. Mickey Mouse and Goofy. We've got some pages from those beautiful um, gold, big golden book. So these are the giant golden books, which have this really interesting um, Disney artwork. So they're, you know, official Disney, but they were just done in this really beautiful kind of style that you don't see in a lot of the later books. We've got a page from an Alice in Wonderland book, another big golden book page for Pinocchio. I love the colours on that one. You've got the Jungle Book, you've got Bambi, another front cover from Donald Duck's Adventure. Some pages from the Donald, that Donald Duck book. Pages from Cinderella. We've got this cute uh, little cutout of a roller coaster at Disneyland. Sleeping Beauty, Bambi, Alice. Some cutouts of Donald Duck. 
Pinocchio and Dumbo together. Goofy. Bambi. This is Don oh, this is from a Donald Duck, Donald Duck in Disneyland book, I think. I love it. Look, he's wearing the old Disneyland uniform. It's great. Some more Donald Duck. And is it Huey, Dewey, and Louie? I never used to watch the Donald Duck cartoons. Got some Mickey Mouse cartoons here. Winnie the Pooh, Tigger. This is a beautiful, some beautiful colours here. It's a Pinocchio page. Uh, we've got an envelope here. This is Cinderella and the Prince. The Prince? Prince Charming? Is that his name? It's an envelope. We've got Snow White. We've got some more comic pages. Happy, Alice, Jungle Book. I love this. I think this was like the opening day at Disneyland and it's all the kids running in through the castle. We've got Bambi here, so Thumper. Some more comic books. Goofy Donald. There. Evil Queen from Snow White, some pages from a Mickey Mouse Golden Book, Pinocchio, and the Jungle Book. So that's one pack. All these packs are pretty similar, and they're just, it's just a great, they're just great little, um, little packs to add to your Disney collection, and if you're making a journal that you want to be 100% original ephemera no printables no new stuff um it's really quite perfect so again you've got the front page of a book and i'm definitely not saying that these are in perfect condition you know that vintage ephemera is not always perfect this is definitely not perfect but it's cute and i think that it would you know you could definitely do something with it why should it end up in the bin we've got princess aurora Comic books. I love the um, I don't know the printing on this particular golden book. It was a it was a seven dwarfs golden book. So Alice, Ooh, my neighbours are particularly loud. I'm having a chat outside. Jungle book. We've got Donald Duck. Ah, Donald Duck with that close. How cute. Cinderella, the Aristocats in here, Alice, oh this is a cute one, it's Bambi's mum and Bambi, or is it Bambi when he was older and I'm not sure, <laughs> Goofy, this is a, um, it was a Halloween story but it had Donald Duck and, are they his nephews, Huey, Dewey and Louie, the roller Pinocchio, another Donald Duck at Disneyland. Here's one that I've cut out of Mickey Mouse. I think this was the story of Mickey and the Beanstalk. So he was supposed to be like Jack from Jack and the Beanstalk. It's a Figaro. Is Figaro the cat from Pinocchio? We've got Christopher Robin and Eeyore from Winnie and the Pooh. You've got this little squirrel from Sword in the Stone. We've got a kind of still from Snow White and Seven Dwarfs. This is some artwork from um, Sleeping Beauty. So that kind of real, um, I don't even know what the art style was of Sleeping Beauty, but I love Sleeping Beauty, just the art of it. It was so different to anything that had been done before. Um, it was just beautiful. So I think this came from a history, like a Disney art history book that I had. Um, and it was talking about the, the art of, of Sleeping Beauty. Some more comic book pages, really large page with Scrooge McDuck and the dwarves. Peter Pan, we've got Captain Hook there. Um, a beautiful um, illustration of the house from Snow White. And Cinderella, 
love that. Comic book pages, Ariel. So like I said, some things from the 90s here. Snow White, another one from Peter Pan. Oh, I love this one, Donald Duck. And a front page from Pinocchio with the, the, the village. Shall I show another one? Maybe I'll just show one more. <clears throat> but like you're seeing, everything's kind of similar, kind of, sim you know, you know, same, same, but different. Um, we've got uh, Tweedledee and Tweedledum, a photo from Disneyland, the Evil Queen from Snow White, more comic pages, Peter Pan, <clears throat> Alice, Another big, another page from um, the Golden Book. This one's not, uh, not in such good condition, but I'm sure that you could definitely cut things out from there. Like I said, this is pretty much my whole collection going into little packs. Um, Mowgli from the Jungle Book. Donald Duck, Cinderella, the mice, Aristocats, the White Rabbit. Alice, Bambi, Winnie the Pooh pictures here. This is a Halloween, again, another one from that Halloween story. Beautiful coloured page from Pinocchio. I love that one. This is uh, Mickey Mouse on Parade. Mickey Mouse and the Beanstalk. A lovely last illustration in Pinocchio. Ah, Winnie the Pooh. This is an envelope of the fairy, the good fairies from uh, Sleeping Beauty. This is Prince. What's his name? Philip, Philip, Prince Philip from Sleeping Beauty comic books, a lovely little picture of Cinderella, some more from Peter Pan, another envelope here with the Cheshire Cat. This is a really, really old Alice in Wonderland page from a golden book, a page from Cinderella, golden book. I love this one. This is two little girls reading Mary Poppins. Very cute. We've got Mickey and Minnie in a little car. Goofy with his football outfit on. More from Peter Pan with Wendy. Um, what have we got? Mickey Mouse and Minnie Mouse and all of them in a car. Another page from Pinocchio and a page from the Jungle Book. This is the first page of the Jungle Book, so it's really, really nice. So I think that's all I will show you for now. I will kind of go around and show you all of the packs here. So one of the packs has a little handmade tag. This is the only handmade tag I have because I made one and then I was like, mm, I'm not making any more. <laughs> um, some pictures from Disneyland from the 50th anniversary of Disneyland. Um, this one is got some cute Alice pictures. Oh, I love this pack because it has a little zippity doodah music uh, page, which is quite cool. Whoops. Um, we've got some Snow White illustrations there. We've got some American Disneyland pictures. And oh, lastly, I love this page from a 1970s, I think, Bambi book. So yes, these are all going to be in my store. If you're watching the video, they'll be in the store. And if you're interested, do go over to my Etsy store and purchase them. I send all of my parcels to any country in the world. Um, so feel free to, um, to pick them up for your own collections. And if you're still watching after my six month hiatus, thank you so much. Um, Cause I really do like making videos. It's just, I, I just, 
find it very difficult with the time now. I actually got engaged in November and so pretty much my whole life until um, until this November is made up for all wedding planning. So, <laughs> so it's hard for me to, to get into the craft room and get some stuff, get anything done, but um, I hope to get on here more often. So if you're a new subscriber, because I know in the last six months I've had a few hundred new subscribers, um, then, then uh, hopefully, Hopefully you're watching too. So thanks for watching and have a fantastic day. And I'll show you my little dog. He's having a little sleep down in his favorite spot, which is underneath my craft desk. So it's bye from me and bye from my little dog, Alfie.